What are radio feed and low feed? Radio feed and low feed are two types of electrical power distribution systems commonly used in transformers. The radio feed system power flows from a single cells or substation to the lows through the a single line of feeder. This means that if there is a fault in the line, the entire system may be affected. In contrast, a loop feed system has multiple cells or substations that are interconnected through multiple lines or feeders, creating a freedom system that allows power to be in the event of fault. In terms of transformers, radio phase transformers designed to receive power from a single cell and distribute it to mild loads, while low phase transformers are designed to receive power from multiple cells and distribute it to multiple loads. The choice between radio phase and loop phase transformers depends on the specific requirements of the electrical distribution system and the load being served. What are the difference between radio and the load systems? Radio feed and load feed systems serve the purpose of distribution higher voltage to lower voltage or vice versa. Radio feed transformers typically have three high voltage positions. Well, loop feed transformers have six high voltage versions H1, A, H2, A, H3, A, and like here H1, B, H1, H2, H3. Consequently, radio feed transformers have a particular construction compared to loop feed transformers based on their appearance. How to choose a low feed or radio feed transformer? The choice between them depends on the specific requirements and the constants of the power distribution systems. Here are some factors to consider. Load characters. If the power demand is relatively constant and can be served by a single assistant point, a radio feed transformer may be more suitable. However, if the load varies widely or multiple circuit points need to be connected, a low feed transformer may be a better choice. System reliability. Low feed transformers offer more redundancy and flexibility, and they can be operated in parallel and can continue to supply power even when transformer fails or needs uh, maintenance. Radio feed uh, transformers, on the other hand, uh, are more valuable to single uh, point failures, which can lead up power outage. Low feed transformers can be more energy efficient, and they can be operated in a way that minimize the uh, no load loss and the reactive excitation currents. Radio feed, on the other hand, may have higher losses due to their uh, similar design and the lack of load balancing capabilities. From the cost effect, radio feed transformers are generally simpler and less than low feed. However, the cost difference may be uh, offset by the need uh, for additional equipment or uh, re redundancy in the power distribution system. Ultimately, the choice between a low feed and a radio feed transformer depends on specific requirements and uh, constraints of the power distribution system. It's important to consider factors such as low character system reliability, efficiency, and the cost to uh, determine the most suitable transformer for the application.